Once your sample is in position, make sure the light is not going to be hit by the saw. Close the door and then hit start. When you hit the start button, the blade should start rotating and the coolant flowing. I'm pulling the lever down slightly just to ensure the coolant doesn't hit the window. You need to wait one minute for the blade to get to speed. Once the blade has got to speed, you pull the lever down, positioning the blade on your sample. When it hits the sample, you will feel resistance and hear a noise. Sparks are flying. You continue slowly moving down through your sample until the resistance or noise fit stops. Then you lift your lever back up hit the stop button and now you can enter the saw. Once your sectioning is finished you need to do the opposite to release your sample. Move your quick release to the center The levers now go to the right to loosen, and then the lever should pull back. Sometimes the lever is difficult, just force it, and the device will pull back, and you have your two pieces sectioned. Now sometimes the smaller pieces will fall down in here. There's a basket in the center to catch any piece that falls. Now you're ready to position a second sample for a second cut or if you're finished for the day just turn the power off and leave the door open to dry.